All right, welcome everybody. Uh, my name is Mark Williams. I'm with the PGA Tour, and we're here to uh, make a special announcement. Um, I'd like to welcome the guests. We have Mr. Vince Pellegrino, the tournament uh, director for the BMW Championship, uh, Mr. Dan and Mr. Paul Fireman, and Keegan Bradley, who is a 2018 BMW Championship winner. So, Vince, I'll hand it over to you to make some comments, and we'll start off there. Thanks so much. Uh, good afternoon, everyone. And thank you for being here with us at Olympia Fields Country Club. Uh, my name is Vince Pellegrino. I'm the Senior Vice President of Tournaments for the Western Golf Association, the organization that stages the BMW Championship. We're looking forward to a tremendous week here at Olympia. And as we kick things off, we'd like to make an exciting announcement about the future of this championship. Uh, it's my honor to announce that the 2027 BMW Championship will be played at Liberty National Golf Club in Jersey City, New Jersey. This, uh, this announcement represents the culmination of years of work between the Western Golf Association and our wonderful partners at BMW, the PGA Tour, and the unmatched venue of Liberty National. Uh, I also want to recognize our partnership uh, in the region with the New Jersey State Golf Association for their support. Uh, I'd like to thank Mike McFadden, president of the uh, New Jersey State Golf Association, who is with us here today. Thanks, Mike. Uh, we're thrilled to bring the PGA Tour and the FedEx Cup playoffs back to Liberty National for the BMW Championship's first visit to New Jersey and the New York metropolitan area. So thank you for all your support. Uh, at this point in time, I'd like to turn it over to uh, Mr. Paul Fireman. That's close enough. Uh, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, I've been caddying since I was 10 years old. That's when I started in golf. And I pretty ordinary area of the world in Brockton, Massachusetts, uh, blue collar at best. And I learned everything about life through my caddying experiences. And then I eventually went on to play reasonably good golf. And to, when we built Liberty National, uh, I've been in a big corporation before that. And when I retired, and now I have this Liberty National, my son and I uh, have developed a course that makes me proud and, e and to have us picked as a future site for both the PGA, the Western Golf Association, uh, and BMW. It's just, it, it brings so much warmth and significance to me because that's everything I've done in my life and my family is about golf. So we're very proud. We're going to do our best to make the opportunity there one of, one that everybody that plays there will be. We've developed the course over years, and we think it's really a, a special place. It has incredible views you'll get to see. And uh, we're proud of the Evans Scholarship Program because that's something that hits me right in the heart, that we can work with people that are going to develop new golfers and new possibilities for people getting educated as a result of golf. So I'll turn the rest over to my son, Dan, who's done most of the work, and he deserved most of the credit. So, Dan. Well, it's, uh, it's, it's, uh, it's a thrill to be here uh, next to my father, next to Keegan, next to Vince, to be able to, uh, you know, finally say that we're hosting the BMW Championship at Liberty. Um, you know, we've hosted some great events over the years. Uh, we're proud of our, uh, you know, what we've done in, in, in hosting men's golf, as well as hosting, most recently, uh, the LPGA with the Mizuho America's Open. Uh, and, and as my father mentioned, um, you know, we also really care very much about the game of golf and we care about giving back to the game and we've done quite a bit around youth golf. Uh, I sit on the board of the first tee. We've had a long-standing relationship with them. Uh, we recently announced a partnership with the American Junior Golf Association where we're supporting the ACE grant program uh, for the next 12 years and now uh, we get to focus on the Western Golf and the Evans Scholars Program which again is an incredible program. Uh, it's something that we're proud to be uh, associated with and you know, we're already identifying children in the Jersey City area and around that we think will be great Evan scholars uh, for the future for, that can caddy and learn at Liberty National and learn the game. And uh, it's a way of keeping this game going. So uh, we're proud that Liberty can be a part of these types of events. And we're also equally as proud that we can, uh, you know, support youth golf as a part of these events too. I mean, we don't just pick these events for the sake of picking them. We, we're very careful about it. So. The fact that we're with the Evans Scholars or the AJGA uh, isn't random. It's really something that we uh, think through, and uh, we're just happy to be here. So thank you. 
Gentlemen, that's a wonderful announcement. Terrific news. Uh, Keegan, uh, you're not from there, but you're close from there. Um, you, you're a champion of this tournament. Um, you've, had, you've played some PGA Tour events that we've uh, previously hosted at Liberty National. Just uh, some comments on the course and returning. Well, I loved Liberty National, but I just found out my man's from Brockton, Mass. So now I love it even more. Uh, I, uh, us golfers love playing in the New York area, metropolitan area. Uh, playing golf in the Northeast this time of year, I think, is the best place to play golf in the world. And when you go to Liberty and you, you're hitting shots and you're aiming at, you know, major buildings in Manhattan, it's pretty remarkable. And uh, I personally love going to Liberty because we play in all these cities, but we don't actually get to stay in the city and explore the city. But for Liberty... We get to stay downtown and we take the ferry over and every day you drive by the uh, Statue of Liberty and it's just a spectacular, it's one of the most, I, I say, I think you can put Liberty with Pebble Beach in terms of shocking views when you're on a golf course and um, I, I'm thrilled. Anytime we get to go to the Northeast to play golf on the tour, I'm excited. Maybe someday we'll play in New England for the, for the maybe. <laughs> Uh, but I'm um, thrilled, and uh, I know all the players are going to be excited. Keegan, um, you pl I think you played a couple of events there, PGA Tour events. Uh, one, you shot four rounds in the 60s, finished T11, but the one I'm interested in was when you finished T33, I think back in 13. Uh, you shot 63 in one of those rounds. What do you recall from that round, and uh, what stood out to you that day? Yeah, I, I, I've always really loved Liberty. There's such a fine line at Liberty of shooting 60 one or two or low score and then you can start whacking balls in the in the woods and in the water there and it's it's a really tough track there's some tough tee shots but uh again it's a very fair course and one that we all love coming to and I think as an athlete anytime you get to play golf or play a sport in New York it just feels a little bigger so uh it's exciting to have the tournament there